Coming up next, a matchup for the UFC featherweight division title. Our tale of the tape for this featherweight championship fight. Both fighters are 27, and they have the same height and reach. And now, one more time for the official introductions. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. <laughs> of the world. Introducing this, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 15 wins, one loss. He stands six feet, one inch tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Pakistan, Russia, presenting the reigning, defending, Fifteen wins, one loss. He stands six feet one is tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighter out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, presenting the challenger, Zombie All right, this is for the UFC Championship. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times, on a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. All right, you ready? You ready? All right here we go. It doesn't get much bigger than this. Five rounds if needed for the UFC Featherweight Championship of the world. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Nice jab. Very good job of timing these shots here. There's that kick. Very nicely done. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Right on the button. Oh, beautiful, beautiful kick to the body. Also, he gets clipped once again here, Joe, and he continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's keeping his head on the center line. He's got to change things up a little bit here. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. Good defense there. Hard hook to the head. And he doesn't get it. He's down. And he switches to southpaw. Straight punch. Useful. Nice body kick there. Lands a punch. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, a lot of volume here. Good series of strikes there. And he eats a right hand there. You gotta be careful when you throw the same technique over and over and over again. The kick lands the liver. He's hurt bad. He's clearly in pain. He's trying to hang on there, but he is in big trouble. Oh, both guys throwing bombs. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Look at this, takedown! Passes from half guard, now into side control. Big body punch. And they both stand up. Tries for a low single. Oh, and down. Now he's in full guard. 
and lose it to half guard. And he gets reversed. And he executed a very nice sweep here and wound up in guard. He lands a big shot from the bottom. Gets the elbow there. He's landing some serious ground and pound strikes here. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here. Nice punch. Elbowing him in the face. Final seconds. That hurt a force speed when he the end of that. Here's a big leg kick. Here's a nasty kick to the body. And here's a perfectly executed single leg takedown. Big round. Nice job. I thought you were gonna knock him out of the octagon. This round, he's a more. He knows you're gonna come hard, so he's gonna be ready. You ready? You ready? All right, round two. The kick gets through. Caught the kick oh, there, Joe. Big oh, right hand. Huge right hand. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. He's got him hurt here. Big right hand. Punch his block. That punch will wow. work right through the gun. Oh. Vicious combination. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. He's really starting to connect Joe on a lot of these strikes to the midsection. Absolutely. Straight right. Able to land to the body there with the left kick. The kick is blocked, Joe. He's blocking almost all these shots. That bruise in his torso is getting much worse. Nice inside leg kick. Missed that shot. Connects with the punch there. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this one oh. goes on. He is rocked right here. He's trying to stay up. He hurt him bad. Big straight punch. Nice leg kick. Straight right, he misses. Leg kick. How about that shin? Really missed with that right hand. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Nice shot. And he gets the single leg. Into the final minute of this championship fight. Joe doing a nice job here staying busy from the back. Look at the bruising on his torso. Full guard. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. And he continues to work the body here. He clipped him. And he's looking for that left. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Oh, massive kick. Lance Bush. Great on the first. Here's a huge punch that stuns. Here we see a beautifully timed kick connects flush. There's a powerful kick to the body. 
amazing highlights from that round. Perfect. Good round. He's rocked. He's still rocked, all right? He's ready to be finished in this match. All right? Get him. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. That last round was absolutely insane. If this round gets off to anything like the last round, one of these guys is going out. I can't imagine a scenario where if they continue where they left off in the last round, that one of these guys doesn't get knocked out. Man, I could watch this guy all day. He continues to land a high number of strikes, just as he did in the previous round. And at least to my amateur eyeballs, Joe, he's not showing any signs of slowing down to Darce choke. He's got the Darce sunk up. And the body work really starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Back to the feet now. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. He's gonna try to take the back, I think. It's covering up, doing a nice job of blocking those shots from the top. And busy as he looks to improve position here. He's working from half guard now. And he landed the right hand there. Back up to his feet again. Oh, bucket him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Caught that one on the forearm. Nice liver shot. You can tell that body shot hurt him bad. Big shot to the liver. He's stunned. He hurt him with that punch from the pinch. Separate. Oh! He's out! Landed a huge kick for the knockout. Well, that was a no doubter, Joe, and he's made a career of knocking guys out with kicks, but that one right there might have just been the best yet. Caught the opponent flush, full force, outstanding extension with the leg, and really, once he connected with the target, you knew the end of the fight was coming, and immediately his opponent goes to the canvas. A major, major result here in this division tonight. And here it is from a different angle. So there is the UFC featherweight champion getting it done with style points tonight by way of knockout. Very impressive championship performance here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Liliano is going to stop this contest at four minutes, six seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC featherweight champion of the world. Well, he's been talking about those two words throughout fight week and new UFC champion. He completes the mission here tonight, and you can see the emotion spilling over. Absolutely incredible what this fighter was able to accomplish, and it is going to take a special performance to dethrone the new UFC champion.